So I'm going to crank this down and see what happens. If we continue to be lucky, then he'll be good. But I want to make sure this is safe. All right, you smart guys, here's a pops quiz. What do you think the ASE test guides say the most important system is on a car for safety? Comment below what you think it is. Watch to find out. So I'm here with Nathaniel Catch, and between the two of us, we've uh, diagnosed this rack and pinion. We're actually here for the YouTube convention, and one of the YouTubers here, they were telling me when they go to back this car out, it's 2001 Hyundai Elantra. I can turn the left a little bit, I can turn the right all the way. All right, the gas pedal kicks back. So I'm thinking, dude, you see that floor mat's way up in the danger zone with the throttle, but how is that causing the throttle to move? I go to turn it, and sure enough, the rack and pinion's walking back and forth. And when you turn right, it hits that throttle and just kicks it back. So Nathan, he's going to turn the steering wheel back and forth. Oh, wait a sec, Nathan. Are you moving it? Yeah, I am. Are you sure? Are you still moving it? Yeah. Just kidding. It's like all over the place. <laughs> <laughs> That's, mechan Dirty. That's mechanic humor. Because you take it to the mechanic, and what do they say? It's not doing it. You yeah, know, yeah. nothing. <laughs> Anyway, we got Zach's jerry rig, everything here. This is not a sturdy fence. <laughs> Don't lean against the fence. There's a lot of broken going on up in here. So you got to check Jack, Zach's channel out, his uh, light bar install there. I'll put a link in the description for that. But we got all these YouTubers. We got YouTuber mechanics, you know, on all sides. And I'm just the guy. I'm a dad. <laughs> The piano gal is my daughter's How channel. does it feel to have such a quick diagnosis? Dude, this though? is sweet. Couldn't have drawn it up better. Good hookup, huh? Well, I owe you guys something, I'll tell you that well, much. Let's see if we can save you some towing. Let's see if we can get this back together for you. Let's do it, let's do it. Awesome. Uh, do you got a jack or should we use the vehicle jack? We got a crappy jack. We can use a crappy jack and a jack, and then we got two layers of protection. We're going to use two jacks just because two is better than one. If one fails, I still have something keeping me and my uh, family provided for. <laughs> you see there's a little cutout and a diagram saying do it behind the front wheel or in front of the rear wheel. So we're going to do that, just get it under the pinch weld here, and uh, just get her cranked up. So that slot is going to correspond with that pinch weld. So it's kind of like a, uh, a tab A and a slot B. Just try to get it where it's the thickest. So you get it started by hand, and we'll jack it the rest of the way up with the handle. We'll just hook this into here. I took the emergency brake off for testing. I'm just going to double check and make sure that's on. These aren't real great if the vehicle starts moving one way or the other. They'll actually bend. I was helping an officer on the side of the road who was coming back from qualifying at the range and he didn't have the brake set and we was jacking it up. I was like, hey, can I help you? I was using that Metabo that I love so much. Started jacking it up. If he was laying on the ground doing it by hand, there's no way he could have hit reverse and put it back down. It would have fell, fallen on him. Go on Metabo. So we're going to turn the steering wheel side to side and use that to get the bolt lined up. That way we don't have to manhandle it. Dude, I listened to Zach and I ate more food at the table there and now I'm bending over and he's like, oh, fat. <laughs> fat and happy though. All right, well, let's get this other jack in. That's about as high as you want to go at this type of jack. That jack's way old, man. I've had it for years. Well, good. We need the experience on this job. <laughs> nice. That's why it's good to have two jacks, you know. If you have to, use to. If I had a jack stand, I'd use that as well. I think I have one of those. You do? Yep, you want it? Yeah, I just said I do. All right. I, I was just doing that. Uh, so this is my truck. Got a bunch of stickers. Where's my jack stands at? Uh, there's one. Ah, perfect. It's awesome because I got all this help. I got a cameraman. <laughs> Can't beat this. This is awesome. So many opportunities come up. I thought I was going to talk to the guys from what's inside, and I'm doing this while I wait. Car? Working yeah, on it. <laughs> this is collaboration at its best. We have a meeting about collab and we apply it instantly in the parking lot. Oh, yeah, that's crazy. We have these whatever. meetings where, you know, like all these uh, eagles learn how to fly and walk home, but not here. <laughs> I'm not positive, but your car might be leaking something. <laughs> no, it's, it had a huge oil leak that I got. You don't have any gloves, do you, Zach? Hang on, I It's got all kinds of slime and grease mud on it. We gotta get you some of that seven mil. Gosh, dang it. <laughs> this, this is the trouble you deal with sometimes. These work for me, so I don't know why he's breaking them off. <laughs> think gentle, think gentle. 
Oh, there you go. These have been in my truck for about three years. So. Yeah, I got my ring on under there. That's going to pinch. Would you mind turning the wheel side to side, as I say? And think gentle thoughts, because if you think hard thoughts, things just get torn up. Yeah, I'll go slow. So I'm going to have my hand on that bolt, and I'm just going to have you go side to side and see if I can get it to drop in. Uh, so when you're ready, just go really slow to the left. Okay, go slow. Maybe not that slow. Okay, keep going to the left. left. Yeah. Go, go more, go faster now. Okay, I can't go anymore. Okay, go back to the right. Maybe it's the other way. There, stop. Go back a little. Right there. What is that, 17 millimeter? I can't tell from here. Hey, Zach, do you got some sockets on you? So I think I got this bolt started by hand with him turning it side to side. If I did, I've like, you know, won the lottery of starting in damaged bolts. <laughs> but it seems to be taking. So I'm gonna make sure I've got at least seven or eight threads in there uh, and see if we can uh, have him move it. And if the rack stays still, I'm gonna keep tightening on this sucker. All right, just go ahead and turn it back and forth. Are you turning it? I'm turning it left right now. Yeah! <laughs> That's just luck. Now it's going right. It's like good karma luck though. Okay. So I'm going to just keep cranking this down because that didn't move at all. Is there another bolt? A nut on the back? Another, just, another bolt on this side. No, it's just a sleeve. Okay. So I'm going to crank this down and see what happens. If we continue to be lucky then he'll be good. But I want to make sure this is safe. The steering system on a car is the most important for safety. More important than brakes or anything. If your brakes go out, you can aim for a bush or you can aim uphill like a runaway truck lane. But if you lose steering, you're hosed. You're going for a ride. And uh, depending on how fast you're going, you don't get to pick where it goes or how long it goes. Yeah, it's binding down. I'm really excited about this for you guys. Yeah! All right, Zach's a lot more musclier than I am. Let's check this guy out. We're gonna show you Zach here. We're gonna have Zach finish this one off. We got it. Look at the guns on that guy. Going in. All right, do you want gloves or are you just gonna do it? Dude, this guy's like a doctor here. He's got the shaved head. He's got the big, he's got the green, you know, scrub look. Yeah. Get it. I think you got it all the way, buddy. <laughs> Pretty stuck. I do okay, but nice. <laughs> you look better doing it. <laughs> cool, well, awesome. How are you feeling about now? Dude, we just I, we just fixed your car. This will be awesome. This will be great. All right, well, let's put it down. We'll have you test it out. Okay, okay we'll do it. All right, so we've got uh, Ben. His daughter's got a channel called the Piano Gal. Yep. Incredibly talented. I was pit against her, and I lost. You know, like she just got a good memory. She remembers all the music, the notes. Okay, so, uh, the truth. Yeah, do it. So previously you couldn't turn. I could turn the left a little bit. You couldn't turn the right at all. It would, it would all right. Stuck. So let's back. Let's back out and let's turn to the right. Turning it to the right. How's that brake pedal? Is that kicking back at you? Nope. How's that make you feel? Turn it right. Shh. Hear that noise, that's my bad car. It's, it's a Hyundai, it's what you got to do it to, a, you I know, 2001. A jackpot. Nice, hit it. Man. <laughs> awesome. Nice You're to meet awesome. you. I'm going to go park and like go tell somebody about this. Awesome, sounds good. Exactly. You're awesome. Okay. Sweet. Teamwork. Dude, where's it at? It's cooperation, that's what it is. I break stuff, they fix it. <laughs> Thanks for the opportunity for service. I appreciate that. Oh, Made a good video. Okay, I'll drive away into the sunset. All right, do it. Okay. At the uh, Utah Pride Center with the uh, rainbow uh, parking chocks. Yeah. <laughs> kind of weird, but whatever. And they were, they were hospitable enough and cooperative enough to let us use their parking lot, so that's awesome. Thanks, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to click like and subscribe. Bonus footage at the end.